I took the shop on a, on a whim and um, it was three weeks into the refit when I was standing here uh, on my own covered in plaster dust and the whole shop was papered up with no natural light and along came James and he turned up on his bike and walked in and nodded his head and then the ne very next day he went back to work and handed his notice in and said I want to come work for you. That was a, that was a very intimidating day. Intimidating but exciting, you know. It's exciting. It's good. My name's Anthony. I'm the co-owner of Cutthroat London, uh, Barber and Parlour, and we're here with Peckham in South East London. Cutthroat London is about giving really great haircuts to anyone, um, regardless of, uh, of who they are. Steve, um, I'm a barber. Kind of, if we, if we want to have our specialities, I tend to specialise in more sharper styles. I do most of the shaving. I like to always finish off with a razor. Anthony's always said that kind of main thing is to never say no to anyone. So we should be able to serve anyone that walks in through the door. We get a lot of women in here who get buzz cuts and kind of quiffs and pomps, and you know what you're seeing is a man's haircut. So I say, if a woman wanted this haircut I'm doing now. She'd be charged the same as Michael. Obviously, she wouldn't get a, a shave, but. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I'm to I mean, same as me. We were looking for the best quality chairs that we could get. I sadly gave away two 1920s chairs about 10 years ago, and I was looking down that route, but I quickly discovered that they wouldn't be functional for what we were, we were looking for. Um, so I was drawn to Takara Belmont uh, with the brand for the quality, and when I explored their range, the dainty chair that we've chosen is the chair that, that is very simple, very easy to use, and it is kind of classic and timeless. A good chair is one of the most important aspects of a, of a shop. I think they've, they've, they come here to relax. You know, some guys come in on their lunch break, they come in on their day off, they come in on a Sunday. It's their downtime. The space is really important for me for the experience of anything that you do in life. So the aesthetic of the shop, for instance, is one of the things that I love about it, is the whole front of the shop opens up in good weather. It, it's a very functional um, and a very practical space, but also it's a nice space to be in. Um, so it's very easy to become very clinical, whereas with definite elements of comfort and softening, which I'm very fond of. My name's James, and I'm the assistant manager here at Cafe. I think to be a good uh, hairdresser or barber, you need to be a good listener. It's a combination of what they want and what you want to, to achieve the best result. You have to use your own knowledge and skills to um, try and steer that in the right direction for them. I mean, this is going to pop up a little bit when it's dry. We've been very pleased with the response and our mission uh, is going in the right direction. I'm overwhelmed and proud in the following that we're building and the team are building for themselves as well. It's pretty good, yeah. Yeah, it's okay. Could always be better. <laughs> <laughs>